Hi, it's Nature Man Jim here. We're at Cheesequake State Park. Today we're going to learn about a catandrominous migration, where the fish are born in salty areas and head for the less salty areas to grow, like this American eel. The American eel has traveled here from the Sargasso Sea, where it's born, an area rich in kelp and aquatic vegetation near the Bermuda Bahama area. As it grows from an egg to a leptocephalus larvae to a glass eel, it travels the ocean currents back to where its parents grew. The eel grows to about three feet in size, changing from a glass eel to an elver to a 12 inch size eel called a whip eel, and finally an adult eel called a green or yellow eel. As they sexually mature, they turn black in color and then silver as they make their way back to the Sargasso Sea to start this reproductive cycle again. American eels are under a lot of pressure as they've been illegally harvested over the years, poaching for the culinary market within the glass eel stage. protected species since 1998 as it's been illegal to harvest the glass eel. Females tend to head for the fresher water as the males head and stay in the estuary or the bay for four to seven years before heading back to the Sargasso Sea. Not many people get to see this adventure, not even naturalists, as the tiny eels are small in size. We hope you enjoyed your journey today through the migration of the American eel and learned a little bit about their life history. Thank you.